Hello, welcome back to the Board Games 4K YouTube channel and this is a channel where we look at tabletop games, card games, board games, all that sort of stuff and we do reviews, playthroughs and all that sort of crap. We don't really talk crap about, about board games in glorious 4K resolution and in this video we'll be taking a look at the very, very simple party game, the Sock Game and in this video we'll be giving you a quick overview of the rules of the sock game we'll be telling you what we do like what we don't like and then we'll come back and we'll tell you whether or not the sock game is worth playing at your next party so if you're new here please consider subscribing to our channel leave a comment in the relevant box down below and we'll see you after this Board games, 4K. So the sock game. Uh, this is a a very very simple party game where in the box you get two really long, colourful socks and you get these these sort of bits of paraphernalia that you're going to stuff inside the socks. And there's two there's two ways to play this game. Well, two two ways to play it in the rule book. There's the standard version and then you've got the sock race version. So in the standard version, what you'll be doing you'll be you'll be spinning the spinner and that will tell you what you've got to look for in the sock, what you've got to pull out the sock. And what you do, you can only use one hand when you're putting your hand into the sock and rummaging around in there. So you'll be feeling around inside the sock, trying to find the artifact that the spinner has told you to find. And if you pull it out, then you get a point and then you spin again, and then you do the same thing. And it's the, I think it's the first one to get five points. So that's, that's how you play the standard game. In the sock race variant, what you'll be doing, you'll be, before you start, you'll be spinning the spinner five times you'll be noting down exactly what piece that you'll be trying to pull out of the sock and you'll be splitting into two teams you'll elect a, a first player for each team and then you'll say go and then it's a quick race to try and find all five items out of sock and when you find one you'll pull it out you'll place it down say you got it and then you pass the sock to the next person and you'll keep going until one team has found all five items out of the sock and that's it that's how you play the sock game so what do we like about the sock game? So the first thing that we really like about this one is that it's it's, it's just so simple, isn't it? There's no rules to this. It's just a case of you know, filling the sock with stuff and then just seeing how you get on. And you know, there's no age limit to this because kids can play it. It's very, very simple, yet it's also very hilarious. The second thing that we like about the sock game is that there's the option to chuck your own stuff in there. So you know, if you wanted to sort of uh, grab a thimble from your Aunt Mabel, then you could chuck that in or you could you know, chuck in some more comedic sort of items into the thing. So there's that, there's that scope for sort of variation and you can expand this game with your own paraphernalia. So the third thing that we like about this one is probably the the sock race variant. It's, it's very frenetic, very fast paced version of this one. It does cause some very frantic games. You know, there's that real sense of tension when you're trying to fumble around in the, in the sock, trying to pull out the, the item that you need. And it, it, some of the items, are, they're really, really difficult to tell what they are inside the sock. You know, and you're constantly pulling stuff out, thinking, hey, I thought that was something else. And you, so you throw it back in. You, you're looking at around at the other, the other team, seeing how far they got with their items. And, and it's really tense and it's really exciting, but it's also absolutely hilarious. So yeah, yeah it's, really, it's a really fantastic party game. So what don't we like about the sock game? So the first thing that we don't really like about this one is the spinner and we hate spinners they're sort of like a relic from sort of the 1970s 1980s and the fact that you're you're sort of spinning the, the wheel and you can't some of the some of the um items you can't really tell what they are you're thinking is that is that this is, is that this sort of, sort, of, sort of washer or is that this this thing and you sort of you're constantly sort of looking at the illustrations of the items that are in the in the sock and you're thinking is it, what, what is this what, what does this mean and it takes a little while to sort of get your head around what they are so that's, that's sort of like annoying so the second thing that we don't like about the sock game is that and it, it's not really a sort of sign on the game itself but it's uh it's maybe something to do with the fact that these types of very very simple games they they run out of steam really quickly and i think once you've played this once maybe you could get two games out of it in an evening you're going to sort of tire of it and you're going to want to put it away 
and then bring it out for another party maybe uh, quite a while later so it's not one of them sort of party games like maybe boulder dash or say anything or something like that where you can play it sort of multiple times over the course of a, a, a smaller period this is one where it does wear thin very very quickly so to summarize is the sock game worth playing at your next party and we say we would say absolutely yes this is a fantastic party game it's it's a it can only be played in limited quantities you don't want to be playing this like every party because people will be like oh it's that one again you want to pull this out for sort of different groups so you know and the fact that anyone can play it you could play it with any anyone who comes around your house to be having a, a dinner party with somebody you could pull this out or you could even if someone pops around you could pull this out you could play it with kids you could play it with older people even middle-aged people like me enjoy this game so yeah it's very very simple it's very very quick to learn it's, there's no rules attached to this one and it's exciting it's hilarious it's funny and um yeah the sock game is definitely one of those games that needs to be on your party shelf right so like we said if you're new here please consider subscribing to this channel help this channel grow and leave a comment down below tell us what you think about the sock game if you've already got it tell us what you think about it tell us why you bought it why you played it and uh yeah we'll see you next time Thank you.